My name is Ryan Schmidt and I work in stainless steel sculpture. Art for me started real early, probably at the age of five, working with origami and uh, got into painting during school. And, um, but that origami was kind of the first introduction to the art world. Well, I started in, you know, coming out of high school uh, thinking that I wanted to study art. So um, I went into painting and sketching and drawing and photography. I went through printmaking, a couple classes in ceramics, got into bronze, and then moved into stainless. And um, I do both the casting process, the lost wax method, as well as the fabrication and sheet metal. And uh, a direct link to the sheet metal and origami is working with the, the two planes, trying to fold and, and stretch and make the uh, the paper or the metal do something that uh, normally isn't uh, wanting to be done. So, so the lost wax method, that's where I'm directly working on an armature with, with metal and applying clay uh, and then a mold is made and that mold is taken, you know, through to, to the foundry to produce a wax uh, where a ceramic shell or a sand cast is, is uh, put on the outside of the, the wax. So the ceramic shell and the, the sand cast can be applied to a wax and then you melt the wax out and you pour in liquid metal about 3,000 degrees for stainless. And that's, you know, the same process for bronze as it would for, for stainless. Uh, the other process that I do uh, is the sheet metal fabrication. So I'm, I'm sketching directly on the metal while it's flat, uh, using four and a half inch grinders and cutoff wheels and, and cutting everything out freehand and then uh, clamps and straps and tension and, you know, uh, the fabrication begins at that point with, you know, manipulating the metal. Cast work, you can do so much more with clay than you can with the sheet metal, uh, but they're both fun. But uh, I, I would say that the clay work is unlimited. Well, I'm sketching, you know, directly from my brain, and so I'm, very little is from another source, I would say. I'm just, I'm thinking and sketching directly as a doodle, basically. And sometimes if I'm working uh, in clay, I'm just it's just free form. So there's nothing, you know, other than just the, the idea of fluid and movement and poise and form uh, that I'm playing with as, it, at the, as that's coming together. You know, learning new techniques and, and processes uh, can be frustrating, so. Uh, especially the, the earlier years of trying to figure out how the metal, you know, is, is going to bend or too much is going to kink it and then you got to start over. And so, it, yeah, the, the earlier years were, were frustrating, but uh, now I'm, I don't, I, don't, uh, I don't push it too far nowadays and, and try to get frustrated. So if I get into a position where it's starting to, you know, mess with me, then I'll stop, take a break and come back to it later. Well, for one, Scottsdale is extremely beautiful this time of year, so uh, you're going to have a lot of good weather and uh, lots of fun things to do. But this show is, is amazing. It's full of uh, really great artists, and um, it's, a, it's, really, it's, a quiet, it's a quiet place to come see some good work. So.